Welcome in, ladies and gentlemen, to the final episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Hardcore Randomized Does Like. Guys, this is the big one. I know we obviously had some up and downs in this run some of the time. I, truthfully, just up until last week, I didn't even think we'd be able to finish this run. But today is the day. We're going to give it a shot. We're going to see if we can make this happen. Now, again... If we lose, there is a binder of cards on the line. I still have to fill some out, but as soon as it is filled out, which will be as soon as this uh, lock ends, of course, it will go to one of you guys if I lose. Now, if I win, I'm keeping all the cards, baby. Let's go. Uh, but I am really excited for this, guys. The whole team is leveled up aside from Lucky, funny enough, uh, who is actually very near leveled up. Uh, he just got burned, and I was like, you know what? I'm just not going to worry about it. He's almost there. So right now, guys... We are heading in and we're gonna see what happens. Now, I do have the XP share on uh, just for reference. So as we go through these battles, hopefully the whole team will level up. Look how beautiful this is. Hopefully the whole team will level up uh, and we can make our way through. Now, level 52 is the level cap for only the first Elite Four member, but we have no rare candies, as we've mentioned in previous episodes. And so this is a bit risky. We're at 52 for most of the team. Hopefully that's enough. <laughs> I don't know. This is a nerve nerve wracking uh, run, honestly. So let's do it, guys. Let's head in. Let's hope we can make this happen. I can't believe we're here. I can't believe we've made it to the Pokemon League. First try. No restarts on this game, uh, which is insane. So let's see if it can happen. I also want to mention as we jump into this, guys, our Pokemon Violet Wonderlock did start yesterday. I hope you guys enjoy that series. It's going to be an absolute blast. Obviously, that first episode was a bit slow, but I think it will obviously pick up. Episode two is already recorded. It's going to be a lot of fun, and I think you guys will have a great time. But here we go, guys. Wigglytuff is the start. That's a little scary. We do know Wigglytuff is a powerhouse Pokemon, but we do also have Dube here. <laughs> so feel pretty good about it. Part of me does just want to Calm Mind uh, and see what we can do here. So let's see if we can make this work. Uh, I did not scale up to like almost level 53. I didn't do any of that. However, some of our Pokemon will naturally be there. Uh, and so just as a heads up, but it looks like fairy type is probably going to be what we're up against this time around. That is a little scary, but with a calm mind up and us having just leftovers and some crazy bulk, I feel like we're in reasonable shape. I feel like a calm mind really helps us out here uh, against some of these later fairy types. I'm just going to water pulse. We're just going to get that stab water pulse in. Let's see how much it does. Ooh, pretty close to enough. Pretty close to enough. That's awesome. Love that. Um... My goal is just not to lose anybody in the first few, uh, man, that was, it's hidden five times every time. That's insane. Uh, my goal is really just not to lose anybody here in the beginning because we did buy some full restores in between episodes, just as uh, a heads up. Uh, and that's going to allow us to full restore up. We do have a couple, I think we have a couple of elixirs and ethers here. So not saying we're going to be able to like fully reset in between every single uh, Elite Four match, but we should be able to at least reset when needed. Uh, and definitely, we've got like 25, 26 full restores, so we should be okay on the health end of things. But that is Pokemon number one gone. Doob is level 53 as well. That is excellent. Lucky already at level 52 as well. There's another Leftovers proc almost getting us back to full. And look at this, we've got a Sylveon up next. So I am just gonna continue the Water Pulse train. This thing does hit like a truck, uh, but I'm not that worried about it. It's gonna light screen. Oh no. Okay. That is a little scary. We could certainly origin pulse and try and like really knock this thing down. Let's just see. Okay, we do land it. That's good. That is not 100% accurate. So that is definitely a bit of a risk, but it still did not take it out. Look at that. All right. It copied the stat changes of Doob, but it's fine. Doob is just sitting here. I'm going to Water Pulse again. There's that full restore. That's fine. Uh, I really just kind of want to get the confusion here. Um, I wish I was better versed in, like, I wish we had, like, a poison type, that kind of thing. Um, we do have steel type, of course, but it's a bit of a risky one. Let's just see what an Ice Beam does. Maybe we'll get a freeze. Who knows? Maybe? Nope, but there is a Moon Blast. Again, we've calm minded. I'm not that worried about this. That does nothing to us. Our special attack does fall. That's not good. Uh, but 
We should be fine. This is actually a bit of a battle in the sense that it's a bit slow, uh, but I think we'll be fine. That light screen is really gonna wear off. We get the confusion, that is huge. I don't see a reason to swap out. That's my thing. We are safe. We don't have to stress. Uh, despite us not doing a ton of damage, there's that light screen wear off. I'm gonna go for that origin pulse. This is the big whammy. Can we land it? We do. Our special attack is down, but that light screen is no longer there. It lived on one. Please hurt yourself. Yes. Sylveon is down. That thing is a menace for sure. Do not love fighting a Sylveon, but we are sitting fairly strong here still. And two, almost back up to full. A Toga Kiss is next. I am just gonna Ice Beam. Whoops. I am just gonna Ice Beam this thing and see how much it does. I don't think it's gonna do too much. Yeah, this thing is just so bulky, you know? Like, it is it is crazy how bulky this thing is. So we do get the leftovers proc. Sky Attack does go up in the air, but it's still here. I'm gonna try an Ice Beam one more time. Okay, we do land it. All right. I thought that would like ascend and then we wouldn't be able to attack it, but it looks like we're fine. That's three Pokemon down, guys, of the first Elite Four member. Also, just worth noting, however long this takes, we are gonna go for it. So keeping in mind, I don't intend that this is gonna be a short episode by any means, but we are gonna push our way through. Let's just Water Pulse this thing. Mawile is strong, but not strong enough. Play Rough coming through. We are so bulky, I'm not even concerned. Imagine if we just sweep the entire Elite Four with, <laughs> with the dude here. So no more full restores, that's fantastic. We're just gonna Water Pulse take this thing out. That thing is out of here. Fantastic. One more Pokemon left, guys. Let's see what it's gonna be. Rex, level 53. We did add Rex to the squad, worth noting. Wanna make sure that is very clear. And here we go, Clefable is the last Mon. Let's just Water Pulse. Let's just see how much it does. Feel really good about this first battle, Metronome. Now this could be scary, guys. We're gonna see what this is good. Oh, it's Nuzzle, oh no! That's actually really annoying. The Para. Oh no! I'm so glad we picked up some full restores, guys. I think we just go for the Origin Pulse and see if we can make this happen. It is, of course, gonna go first, that's fine. Looks like Double Slap, not worried about it. Eventually, we will break Para, even if it's not this first time around. And uh, as long as we land that Origin Pulse, we'll be in good shape. We do use it, we do land it. This should take it out. Beautiful, that is a first win for us using only Doob, who is astounding. Grizz gains a level there, level 53. Sitting pretty good for the next one. I am feeling very good about this. Honestly, I don't know that we change up the lead here. Doob is absolutely perfect for us. It's just such a strong mon. I think we just gotta run for it uh, and see what we can do. This is looking so solid to kick things off. Let's see what we can make happen, guys. I believe in us. Look how beautiful each of these Elite Four member rooms is. It's just stunning. Look at these little ghosts. Oh, I love that. Absolutely love that. That ominous wind. Hey, yo. <laughs> Flying through those lotus petals. Oh my God, they're beautiful. All right, guys, here we go. Let's make it happen. I believe this is Phoebe. Let's do it. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. We got this. Ghost type Pokemon? I highly doubt it. Let's see what it's gonna be. She's so just ominous with the way she's just swaying. You know what I mean? Like, it's just a little, like, you never know. She's terrifying, even though she's, like, she's got, like, a Alolan looking vibe, but. Here we go, Elite Four Phoebe, let's make it happen. Come on, guys. Let's see what we got, a Shuckle. Could be a rock type, uh, as in her typing could be a rock type, which that's great. <laughs> uh, this is the best lead possible, if that's the case. I am just gonna Water Pulse away and we're gonna make this happen. Really, this should be a Calm Mind all day. We could theoretically just set up, um, but it's gonna guard Split, is that what it did? It swapped defenses with us. Oh, I don't like that. Is that what it did? I did not read, I was clicking way too fast, but it's fine, Shuckle is gone, we're fine. Uh, fantastic, another level for Doob, sitting at 54, feeling really good about that. Saint is level 53, that's an important one. Saint is huge, and here we go guys, it is Rock-type. That's perfect. 
we just water pulse everything. Easy. Easy. Look at this. Come on, can we sweep with Doob? We are at 200 HP, look at that. Ooh, I got a little scared there for a second, but we're good. I'm just gonna water pulse again. I don't think I need to origin pulse yet. Not gonna stress about it. It trick rooms, okay, fair enough. Trick room is definitely a bit scary depending on what they have. Stone Edge shouldn't do that much. Yeah, we're fine. And again, we're just so bulky. I, I don't have a lot to worry about here. Um, Mew getting to level 53, I love it. Our whole team is getting some levels here, guys. That just means in case of a type check on the next uh, Elite Four member, we will be in great shape. Here is a actually pretty scary Mon. I'm gonna Ice Beam here. They Light Screen. I hate Light Screen against Doom, but it's fine. Ice Beam should do nothing. Okay, I miscalculated. <laughs> Uh, let's Origin Pulse here. Let's just see. It's gonna hail. Fascinating. Okay. None of these mons have been crazy damage dealers. I will say that. I feel like we're not against- It has dry skin! Oh no! Oh, we're gonna have to swap here, guys. Nothing can touch- We cannot touch this thing. Aurorus, man, what a mon. Uh, okay, so what do we go into is the question. You know, I honestly don't feel super confident that I know what Aurorus is weak to. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see what it's weak to. I, I'm, okay. Rock, fighting, water, ground, grass, and steel. So is it, it's rock and ice. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. I think we just go for Grizz here. And we can EQ. Um, I'm a little worried that this thing is going to have like an ice type move to really hit Grizz, but it's gonna encore instead, which should be fine. Um, now Trick Room, okay, Trick Room is gone, which means we should outspeed as well. So I'm gonna EQ this thing. This should, I mean, we are really powerful and we do take it out. Fantastic, not a problem. Grizz doing the most lucky getting to level 53. Come on now, we are getting there. And it's another Aurorus, which means we should be able to EQ, take this thing out. It's the same level, so in case of a defense difference, that's the only thing that could really mess us up, and it doesn't. And we make it through. That is Elite Four Phoebe down. Guys, two down. Halfway through the Elite Four. Can you imagine getting through this without any losses? Let's go. We are halfway there. Champion is obviously still left to go. That's going to be a very terrifying battle. But for right now, we are going to just full restore up our team. Understanding we really don't need to full restore up the whole team right now. But let's just be safe. We've got the full restores. I'm going to use them. Here we go, guys. Look how beautiful this is. Again, I'm going to lead Doob. I don't see a reason to fix what isn't broken. Doob is just annihilating right now. So let's do this. I really, really hope we can win this. Oh, that's so cool. Look at that. Ooh. You know what? I am gonna be safe. Uh, I saw some frame skips there. We haven't had an issue since I swapped setups, but just wanna be safe. We're gonna save the game right here. Let's do it, guys. Here we go. She is also terrifying. She's got like a Cinderella Ice Queen vibe. Maybe Elsa vibe, I don't know. Let's go. Glacia. Let's do it. What do we have? A Wormadam. That could also be Rock type. Am I wrong? Uh, this thing is actually really annoying, but we'll do the best we can here. Um, I really hate Wormadam. It's one of the most annoying mons. I don't know why it's so bulky and so fit, but here we go. We one-shot it. Get it out. Let's see what the next Pokemon's gonna be. That was an easy takedown, thankfully. And it's Victory Bell, which means... Wow, Grass-type is the move here. You know, honestly, I'm gonna be safe here. We're gonna swap into Saint. Um, Saint is gonna get that download push for either attack or special attack, and regardless of which way we go, let's see. It's attack, so we Fire Fang everything. We should be in really good shape here. This is gonna do nothing to us. We are Assault Vested as well, uh, and so this thing is truthfully just going to sweep, I imagine. We'll see. 
it. <clears throat> Almost. Not enough. Leaf Blade could land a crit, but it does not. Oh, that was a crit. Wow. Uh, let's wing attack. Obviously, they're gonna full restore here. That's fine. I kind of don't want to get them back into the red and then they just full restore again. So wing attack might not get them that far down. Yeah. Um, all right, let's fire Fang. Get it out. I actually really love Victory Bell. Claire, you know. Uh, <laughs> Victory Bell is very good. Um, Dube level 55. My goodness, Dube is killing it. All right. Executor, definitely an interesting mon here. I'm gonna try for a flamethrower. I know we got the attack boost, but I think this thing is just generally physically bulky, and flamethrower one-shots it, not even a problem. Level 54 on Saint as well. Really taking us over the top here. Grizz level 54 also. Rex level 54, my goodness. Discharge, uh, actually, 80% or 80, 80 damage and the chance to para, I will take it. I think that just gives us better options than Electro Ball, so let's do that. Ludicolo is next. This is actually a bit of an interesting one, but we do have the wing attack for just such an occasion. Obviously, part water type means that flamethrower not gonna do it. We get the crit with the wing attack, taking it out. I have no clue if that mattered. I kind of doubt it, but you never know. And here we go, guys. The last Pokemon for Glacia. We're gonna flamethrower away, hoping to knock this out in one shot. Can we do it? Yes. Easy. We are three for three, no losses, guys. Let's keep it going. We are also only at 17 minutes, maybe? 16, 17 minutes? We are killing it, guys. Now, obviously, each and every uh, battle in here is a scary one, so definitely keeping in mind that at any possible moment, we could be losing this game. So we do have to be careful, but so far, so good, guys, and I'm really optimistic. We've got two more battles left. In the run that I didn't think we'd be able to finish, we are really doing well thus far, so let's hope we can keep it up. <sighs> Come on. Let's make it happen, guys. Oof, man, that's so sick. I just love these room animations. They are so sick. Let's do it. Last Elite Four member is here. Let's take him on. Look how impressive he looks. He's so intimidating. So stoked. I can't believe we're here. I can't believe this is the last episode. Regardless of what happens, this is the last episode. It is insane. All right, Drake, let's do it. Ooh, that animation, did you see the chunk? Oh, that's so cool. Braviary to kick things off. So I'm guessing it's either normal or flying. It kind of has to be. This is perfect though for Dube because we can just Ice Beam away and see what the typing is on the next Pokemon. Now we do only have five Ice Beams. We should have elixir up, but I think this is actually good for us. This is gonna present a challenge because we can swap into Rex, but Rex against flying types, not always the best. And here we go, it is a Halucha next, which means it is going to be flying type. Uh, but I don't love the idea of swapping. Ice Beam, I don't know if this works. Because it's part fighting type, I am not sure. It is still super effective and it does one shot, awesome. All right, Dube, can we just sweep with you? Let's see if we can do it. I I will say there is something really fun about, oh, this isn't gonna be the best. There's something really fun about sweeping with Kyogre in Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. So if we can make it happen, I mean, we gotta try it, right? Okay, so they are definitely going to heal up here. I'm just actually gonna Water Pulse. <laughs> Excuse me. We are in the rain and I don't need to kill. I just need to get enough damage off on this thing. And we definitely do. That's not even very effective. I'm gonna go for another Water Pulse. A Tailwind. They are outspeeding like crazy here, guys. That's totally fine. Given how bulky we are, I'm not that stressed about it, but this should take it out. That's great. That means we preserve those Ice Beams for these final couple Pokemon. Lucky getting to level 54. Absolutely love it. I will say, guys, it's been insane. The team that we have put together here is awesome. Quiver Dance, no! That's actually really scary. We should be okay, but obviously Quiver Dance is a terrifying move. It is so powerful. But on a Masquerade, it's not gonna do enough and we still one-shot, guys. Dube is doing so much. Firo is the last Mon here, level 53. We definitely have this. It's gonna Drill Peck. 
Not even close to enough. Not anything. I mean, dupe is just so bulky. There's a world where I feel like I'm cheating because I'm using dupe, but it, it is a legendary. We did catch it fair and square. You guys saw it in a previous episode. This is not cheating. This is just the mon that we have. Saint gets to level 55 and Drake is done. The Elite Four is done. And guys, we only have one more battle for the win. This is it. This is so intense. I, for me, it's really intense. I know for you guys, I, hopefully it is. I don't know. For me, it's insane. I feel like we need to use a different Mon here. No, you know what? We're just going to do it. We're going to full send, man. We have to. He's done so much for us already. Each of the moves has been learned, but okay. Let's just do it for Doob. PP was restored. We are in good shape, guys. Let's do it. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Look how epic this is. Oh, 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 I forgot. I forgot how cool this is. Here it is. Oh my God, that slow pan. Oh. Steven. It's time, bud. We're taking you down today. I believe we can do it. I truly do. He is going to have, I believe, a guaranteed Mega, just to be clear. This is it. Let's see if Kyogre can wreck him. Oh my god. Thumbnail. Gotta be. It kind of gives it away that we make it, but thumbnail. Oof. Again, some frame skips here, but here we go. Let's do it, guys. Come on, a jump pluff. Okay. Ooh, lots of frame skips. I'm a little concerned now. I'm so glad I saved. <laughs> all right, here we go. We just ice beam. All day, every day, we just ice beam. This does so little to us. Let's see what it's gonna be. It's either flying or grass, and it is gonna be grass. So this might be a good time to swap into Saint. Level 57, by the way, too. That's a little scary. I think I am just gonna hard swap into Saint here. This thing can barely touch Saint, in my view, uh, and maybe I'm incorrect, but I, I feel like it's just got nothing for us. We're gonna get the download, pushing our special attack. They are gonna full restore, that's fantastic. I'm just gonna flamethrower. We got the special attack boost. I feel like this is perfect for us. Let's see if we can just one shot it. Let's go guys, come on. Obama snow, easy. Okay, so this is part ice type, which is why they went out to it because they, we are obviously dragon, but dragon fire, that's nothing. We easily knock it out. Saint is gonna sweep guys. I think Saint's gonna do it. Drill Run, I'm gonna go ahead and say no to Drill Run. At this point, we do not need a better move. We have got the best moves possible, I think, for each of these mons. I feel good about the movesets, by the way. I didn't know TM swapping anything like that in between episodes. You saw we just learned Discharge on Rex, but that's the only move swap that we've seen. Everything else has stayed the same. Here's the Ludicolo. Again, that's perfect because we do have the wing attack. Should be able to at least two-shot. There's a nature power into try attack. That is actually a little scary. I don't know what that could. Okay, no status, phenomenal. We're gonna wing attack. That's gonna take this thing out. We're gonna do it with no losses. Come on. Fire spin, absolutely not. That move is garbage. Is this the last Mon? I think this is the last one. No, there's two more. Okay, that's fine. We flamethrower all day. We've got that special attack boost. Guys. <laughs> Excuse me. So excited, I just coughed. Oh, what an epic final battle. Venusaur and, oh, here we go. Mega Venusaur and Mega Charizard. What a picture perfect end, guys. It is level 59, just to be clear. This is a very powerful mon, but not powerful enough. Yes, we did it. Guys, 
We have won the Nuzlocke, which means this binder is mine. You don't get to keep it. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. I am so excited that we have made it to the end of this run with a win. This completes what is honestly something I didn't think we'd be able to finish again because of those tech glitches last week. I did not think we'd be able to finish this run. I had no clue we'd be able to even get to this point, uh, but we did. We've made it. We made it happen. Guys, that is another win in the books. That means, let's just double check. Pokemon Emerald, we won. That was our short Snuzlocke previous to the Soul Silver Nuzlocke. We did win that one after a restart. Pokemon Y, after a restart, we won. And now Alpha Sapphire, no restart. We've got another win. Guys, as we do round out the end of this run, a huge thank you. I cannot express to you guys how much I appreciate all of the support, not just on this series, but all of the, the content, the channel as a whole. We are reaching some incredible milestones very quickly, one of which is 1,000 videos. We are almost there. Look at Dube just sitting so proud. Grizz, love Grizz. Oh, lucky. We didn't use half of our team, but we still did a great job. Saint is here. Rex, who really carried us through a lot of the game. Rex has been awesome. And then Mew, one of my favorite Pokemon. I absolutely love Weavile. And look at them in the round, guys. How sick is that? I really do appreciate it, guys. Again, the support that you guys have shown on the channel as a whole has been incredible. We are actually really close, not just to a thousand videos, we're close to monetizing this channel. Now that doesn't actually mean much in the grand scheme of things, but we're close. And that is another milestone that I hope to achieve by the end of the year. We are almost there now. And here we go, guys, look at this. A beautiful moment with May. Absolutely love that they threw this in the game, by the way. It's such a tender, just beautiful little moment that they threw in here. I think it's stunning. Oh. Awesome. Oh, look at the, the little blush. Oh, so sweet. There we go. Guys, I'm so proud of this channel. I'm so proud of this, this series. I'm so proud of the content that's been coming out lately. I'm proud of the community that we have built more than anything else. You guys are amazing as we finish up this game. Look at us just riding our bike. Oh, thank you. Thank you all so much. I, I can't express to you how much it means to have such a great community backing me and the content that we are creating together. It's an absolute blast. I love you all. I really hope you have enjoyed this series. If you did, please leave your favorite moment down in the comment section. Maybe your favorite Pokemon that we had on the team. Maybe it was you. Maybe we got you on the team. Look at that. May just shows up beside us. Leave it down in the comments, guys. Thank you so much. I have no clue what we will be starting. Uh, I may wait until next week to give it a start, but we will have something else in the Monday, Wednesday, Friday slot very soon. Really excited for that as well. Guys, I love you. Have a fantastic day. See you soon.